the James Webb Telescope has simply uncovered the clearest picture of Proxima b in history, revealing shocking insights into a possibly habitable exoplanet. It obliges us, as we set out on a journey through space, to uncover the secrets of Proxima b and find out whether it could be the next Earth. We should take off into the enormous expanse of space where a mysterious planet exists in the habitable zone of its star, Proxima Centauri. This planet isn't just any normal rock, it's a world. See, Proxima b is located a mere 42 light years away from us. This planet is shrouded in secrets and wonders. Could it be another Earth, with oceans and life thriving on its surface? In any case, wait, there's something else. Proxima Centauri b isn't the only one in its orbit around the red dwarf star, it has a companion, Proxima Centauri c. And who can say for sure what other secrets the star system holds? Perhaps there's another companion that we have yet to discover. The mysteries don't stop there. Proxima Centauri emits roughly the same amount of energy from its star as Earth does from the Sun. Could this really mean that there's water on its surface and maybe even life? As we explore beyond our own solar system, we encounter a completely unique universe of exoplanets, planets that orbit stars other than the Sun. With 200 billion stars in the universe, the potential opportunities for exoplanets are endless. Some exoplanets even wander freely, untethered to any star, like wandering wayfarers in space. Among them all, Proxima Centauri b stands out as an especially striking and intriguing planet, with a year that lasts only 112 Earth days and a distance from its star that is generally closer than Earth is to the Sun. Without a doubt, one side of the planet is constantly bathed in sunlight while the opposite side remains in eternal darkness. Now, let's discuss Proxima Centauri, the star that Proxima b orbits. Proxima Centauri is part of the Alpha Centauri triple star system. This system includes Rigel Centaurus, otherwise known as Alpha Centauri A, and Alpha Centauri B together, these stars form the closest star system to our solar system. The two stars, Rigel Centaurus and Alpha Centauri B, form a binary system known as Alpha Centauri A and B. These G and K type stars appear as one star in the constellation Centaurus and are the third brightest stars in our night sky, with a peak brightness of under 2.7. Proxima Centauri, also called Alpha Centauri C, is a red dwarf or M-type star, found 21 light years away from the other two stars, generally about four times the distance between Earth and the Sun. It is, in fact, the closest star to us. Proxima Centauri means the closest star in Latin, and it was discovered in 1915 by Scottish astronomer Robert Thorburn. Despite being our closest celestial neighbor, it is not visible to the naked eye, having an apparent magnitude of 11.13, which is much fainter than the human eye's limit of 6.5. However, don't let that fool you, Proxima Centauri is still a star worth studying. Red dwarfs like Proxima Centauri are among the most efficient in terms of energy production. They may not produce a lot of energy, but the internal convection processes at their centers keep them shining for trillions of years. As a general rule, Proxima Centauri will remain a main sequence star for another 4 trillion years. However, the habitability of a red dwarf star like Proxima Centauri is still debated. For one thing, it's a flare star, meaning it has frequent and intense outbursts. As a low-mass star, its habitable zone would be much closer to it than the Sun's, projected to be somewhere in the range of 0.23 to 0.54 astronomical units. Yet, it's not as habitable as it appears. Proxima b is bombarded by intense ultraviolet radiation from its star, commonly stronger than the radiation we receive from our Sun. That's right, it's so intense that even the lightest molecules of hydrogen are stripped away, along with nitrogen and oxygen. However, that's not all. Just because a planet is at the right distance from its star doesn't mean it can support life. Proxima b might not have a stable atmosphere, which is essential for regulating temperature and maintaining a water-friendly surface. Without it, living organisms would be vulnerable to harsh space weather conditions, making life nearly impossible. So while Proxima b may seem Earth-like on the surface, it is far from being able to support life. People remain somewhat skeptical, as there are many factors that render it inhospitable. The mission to uncover the truth about Proxima b continues. Some individuals still hold hope. One tool that has caught the attention of astronomers is the James Webb Telescope. After years of anticipation, the telescope was finally launched in 2018 and will help us determine whether there is life on Proxima b. As with everything in science, things are never as clear as they seem. Various adjustments were needed to ensure that the James Webb Telescope delivers accurate images. As Abby Tabor, a theoretical physicist at Harvard, explains, if a planet like Proxima b can absorb light from its star, it can also emit it as infrared light. The James Webb Telescope was specifically designed to detect infrared light. 
It can capture images of this light on the planet's surface and search for patterns that could confirm the presence of water or an atmosphere. However, what if the planet has an atmosphere that isn't conducive to life? The presence of an atmosphere doesn't guarantee the presence of life, warns Ed Turner, an astrophysicist at Princeton University. Proxima b could be like Venus, with a thick atmosphere that is significantly denser than Earth's and extreme temperatures that would make it impossible for life to exist. The journey to unravel the mysteries of Proxima b isn't without its challenges. While the James Webb Telescope holds promise, there are other factors to consider. With costs mounting, space researchers are under pressure to find ways to observe planets like Proxima b. A lot is at stake, but the rewards are even greater. The opportunity to explore the unknown, to reveal the secrets of a distant planet that holds the promise of life, is an inspiration worth pursuing. If the exoplanet were habitable, could we one day visit it? It's the closest exoplanet to us, which makes it so exciting, almost like exploring our own backyard. Even more enthralling is that it's roughly the same size as Earth, and its position in the habitable zone suggests it could indeed have conditions suitable for life. Proxima b's proximity also makes it an ideal target for our quest for life beyond Earth. With it being so close, it's an excellent candidate for interstellar missions. Consider the possibility of exploring this Earth-like exoplanet. Although we can't yet go there, it's certainly on the radar for future missions as technology advances. It's one of the most exciting endeavors in the field of space exploration. However, it's no simple task. It would take 75,000 years for spacecraft like Voyager 2 to reach the Proxima Centauri system. Nonetheless, a solution has been proposed, solar sails. These ultra-thin sails could be used to propel a spacecraft to the Alpha Centauri system and Proxima alongside it. This technology utilizes solar pressure to keep the spacecraft on course, eliminating the problem of running out of fuel. And here's something even cooler, this cutting-edge technology could provide insights into the possibility of life on other planets like Proxima b. However, as with anything this ambitious, there are limitations. For instance, the presence of an atmosphere doesn't necessarily guarantee the presence of life. Proxima b could be like Venus, with a thick, hot atmosphere that is uninhabitable. Additionally, the James Webb Telescope can detect such emissions if it reaches a brightness of just 5% of the daytime side. Now, 5% might not seem like much, but when dealing with a star that is generally dimmer than our own sun, it's quite significant. If Proxima b has advanced civilizations, they might be using bright orbital mirrors to reflect sunlight from the daytime side to the nighttime side. How cool is that? There are countless exoplanets waiting to be discovered in our universe. These planets come in all shapes and sizes, with some being enormous gas giants, while others resemble our own Earth. But what do we know about them? One type of exoplanet that has caught the attention of space researchers is the gas giant. These planets are similar in composition to Jupiter and Saturn but are much larger. Some of these behemoths have been dubbed Super Jupiters, surpassing even the largest planet in our solar system. But that's not all. There are also hot Jupiters, gas giants that orbit incredibly close to their host star, existing in a scorching world with temperatures that could melt metal. Imagine seeing such a planet up close, with its raging storms and extreme heat. In addition to gas giants, there are also Neptunian exoplanets, which have sizes similar to Uranus and Neptune. Among these are the hot Neptunes and small Neptunes, which are smaller and closer to their host stars than their gas giant cousins. These planets are often shrouded in mystery, with their atmospheres being difficult to study from afar. And let's not forget the terrestrial exoplanets, which resemble our own Earth. These planets come in various sizes, ranging from smaller than our planet to twice its size. There are even super-Earths, which have masses more than twice that of our planet but are lighter than Neptune. One of the most fascinating exoplanets recently discovered is Proxima Centauri b, which orbits the star of the same name. This planet is classified as a terrestrial exoplanet because of its rocky surface, which is why it's drawing so much attention. Scientists speculate that there might be life there, but we won't know for sure until we explore it further. It is hard not to wonder, are there alien civilizations out there waiting?